let us compliment this guy because mm -hmm. he's too mod modest to do it himself. But this is a guy who has cared about our troops. You have spent years speaking about them. You've spent years traveling to entertain them. And Jay always gets to know individual soldiers and really kind of binds with them. And I know you have a really great story for us this morning. Yeah, this really is. A specialist Stephanie Moore was stationed at Bargram Air Force Base in Afghanistan when she was wounded. She spent a year at Walter Reed Medical Center, a piece of her life back together, and it took me uh, just a few hours, well, I spent a few hours with her, actually, uh, to learn that, you know, heroes are, are, well, they're just born after the dust has been settled, so to speak. Uh, here, take a look. Specialist Stephanie Morris had just exchanged birthday gifts with a roommate when the grenades hit. Two RPGs came in back to back. I was on the ground and I seen everybody else land there. I started screaming. She wrapped her present, a Mickey Mouse blanket, around her best friend to stop the bleeding. It was something you never want to see, your own child. Just laying flat in that bed with tubes and blood everywhere. and It was just, it was too much. It's the day that she lived and they didn't. It was a day that she fell asleep in one country and woke up in another. And it was a day that she looked down and her body wasn't the same. She spent the next three years at Walter Reed fighting to save her leg. How do you push forward when you were the only survivor and the other four were KIA? Slowly through the sport she once loved, Stephanie found her way back. And after three dozen failed surgeries, she'd had enough. On July 4th, doctors amputated Stephanie's leg. You always hear about the greatest generation, but you realize every generation that fights is really the greatest generation. If I can do something to help her or just make her smile or laugh, hey, I've done my job, I hope. How are you? Hey, How you doing? What's going on? I'm guessing that's Stephanie. Hi, Steph. How you doing? How are you? I'm okay. This looks hard. You want to play? I can tell when I'm being hustled. Do I want to <laughs> play? Yeah. And put your feet back. Oh, back because here. Because if somebody clip them, you oh, might okay. end up like me. Okay. <laughs> you guys play hard. Awesome. Though I obviously have no game, we do have one thing in common. We both like to go fast. We can race in wheelchairs and we'll see who the fastest. All right, sure. Go. Hey, no cheating. Hey. Come on. Nice. Remember the tortoise and the hare. <laughs> All right, you ready for some real wheels? Yeah. <laughs> I'll take you for a drive. You're crazy. It's a beautiful day. You can't do that. Good day yeah. for convertible. And a great heart to heart as we cruise through Virginia along the banks of the Potomac. So the worst part is over now? Um, yeah. Regardless of what goes on, I've dealt with the worst of the worst of what my life is going to be. There's nothing I can't overcome. You want to uh, give this thing a try? Sure. OK. Now, I'm not saying I'm going to be a good driver, uh -oh. but. Step on it. Go, baby, go, baby. Cars do you have? Oh boy, you sound like my wife. Uh, <laughs> about 150. 150 cars? Yeah, yeah, I know. <laughs> I'm probably that way with shoes. Well, there you go. How many <laughs> shoes you got? 70 pairs. 70? Yeah. We covered a lot of ground on our little road trip. Stephanie studied to become a nurse. She's engaged to be married. And she misses her mom back in Ohio. If I would have known you were going to be here, maybe I would have flew her down here. Uh huh? Yeah. <laughs> that would have been cool. <laughs> All right, Mount Vernon, half a mile. Time for a little history lesson. <laughs> this is amazing. So you've never been here, huh? No. This is your commander in chief's house. <laughs> this is where Washington sat. As a soldier, what do you feel like? My heart's beating a little fast. Actually, yeah. just be sitting up here. It's like a uh, dream come true, actually. Yeah. I mean, so much history. You've never seen this memorial, have you? No. 
The Purple Heart was originated by George Washington himself. Yeah. And you've got one. I do. I mean, that's pretty impressive. It's really like just bittersweet. Yeah, I know. I know <laughs> what you mean. You certainly deserve it. How you doing? You all right? Come on, I got one other thing for you. Let's go down here. <laughs> I'll show you the real reason I brought you down back. There's one more surprise for Stephanie. <laughs> we brought our mom, brother, and nephew in from Ohio. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> hey, Marcus, what do you think of that car? Jay will let you drive. I'll tell you what, Marcus. He'll let you drive it. And Stephanie can let you drive. Get your car. <laughs> Thanks for your service. That's not funny. <laughs> it's your car. No. It's your car. Thank you. That should be on an endless loop. Yeah. That and was the amazing. folks at Fiat Chrysler, they gave us that little Aboth Spider, the Fiat Spider, and they paid all the taxes. Wow. So she, you know, and we outfitted it with controls so she could drive with her other foot. But she's getting a prosthetic leg, so she won't need that pretty soon. Right. But, uh, Amazing. Yeah. yeah. She that wanted the sports car. I thought, should we get her something we can carry a wheelchair? <laughs> no, no, I want the sports car. So we gave her the sports she's car. She's like, don't so. even yeah, think even about you. it, Eddie. Uh, I know. I know. Yeah. She got all of us. Yeah. Yeah. That was beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. Thank you so yeah. much. Yeah. She's Great just stuff. a wonderful kid. And you know, Walter Reed's filled with them. Yeah. You pick anyone at random, <laughs> and they all got a great stuff. They're the best of our country. Yeah. No yeah. question. Jay, thank you. I know you're going to be back in our next hour. <laughs> Darn you, Leno. I know. I know. Okay. If you want to see more cool cars, you can also check out new episodes of Jay Leno's Garage. It returns next Wednesday night on CNBC. Lots of laughs and fun as well. Hello today, fans. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Subscribe by clicking that button down there. And click on any of the videos over here to watch the latest interviews, show highlights, and digital exclusives.